Each time you start up your Mac, it automatically launches a powerful application called the Finder. The Finder offers access to everything on your Mac and to everything you connect to your Mac. Much of the work you do on your Mac takes place in a Finder window. Don't see a Finder window open? You can always open a new Finder window by double-clicking the icon of the Macintosh hard drive on the desktop. Or you can click the icon for the Finder in the dock where it's always the first icon. While the contents of the Finder windows you use may differ, all Finder windows share a few things in common. That includes having a sidebar. Located along the left side of every Finder window, the sidebar offers a handy portal to the applications, files, and folders you use on a regular basis. To help you navigate to them easily, the sidebar is divided into four sections. Devices, Shared, Places, and Search For. The Devices section lets you see at a glance the drives you have available. That includes internal hard drives, like your own Macintosh hard drive, external hard drives, CDs, DVDs, USB flash drives, or even your iPod or iPhone. If you're working on a network, at home, work, or school, the Shared section of the sidebar lets you see at a glance all the computers, both Macs and PCs, and servers on your local network. Click one, and with the right password, you can share files with a colleague or even open a file remotely. The next section, Places, provides quick access to some of the key destinations on your Mac. That includes the Desktop folder, Home folder, Applications folder, and the Documents folder. The Search For section can be very handy. It includes smart folders that let you quickly find files based on the type of document they are or the last time you modified them. And we call them smart because they let you find files without having to remember where on your Mac you store them. Did you know that on a Mac you can view files the way you like? It's one of the great features of the Mac Finder. Using the Finder's View buttons, you can tell your Mac to display the contents of the active Finder window in Icon, List, Column, or Coverflow View. The last of these, Coverflow offers a very visual way of browsing through the documents in a folder. It lets you flip through documents like you flip through albums in iTunes, making it easy to spot the items you're looking for. And when it's time to take an even closer look at a document that looks interesting, you can take advantage of another Finder feature called Quick Look. Quick Look lets you view the entire contents of a document without taking the time to open the application that created it. Just select a document you want to review and click the spacebar. With Quick Look, you can flip through multi-page documents, play an entire keynote presentation, even watch full-screen video with a single click. If you have questions about the Finder, check the built-in help on your Mac by switching to the Finder, clicking the Help menu in the Finder's menu bar, and entering Finder in the search box.